Astronomers using ESO's very large telescope have discovered gas halos around some of the universe's earliest galaxies formed more than 12.5 billion years ago. Those reservoirs of cool gas provide food for the supermassive black holes located at the center of most galaxies. Black holes consume dust and gas from surrounding galaxies in order to grow. This explains how supermassive black holes, which likely formed due to the collapse of the first stars, were able to grow so large and so quickly in the early universe. Up until now, astronomers had not witnessed any evidence of enough black hole food to support the growth. Using the very large telescope, the astronomers studied 31 quasars, which appear today as they would have been over 12.5 billion years ago when the universe would have been around 870 million years old. An infant in astronomical terms. 12 of those quasars were surrounded by huge halos of cool, dense hydrogen gas extending 100,000 light years from the central supermassive black holes. However, they remained closely bound, offering a potential food source for these supermassive black holes. The astronomers said that with the current studies, we are only just beginning to investigate how the first supermassive black holes were able to develop so rapidly. <laughs>